Because I can't believe we've been just up here in the hospital. <laughs> Jeez. You know, I guess we should just be happy with the go-kart race. Yeah, I mean, getting back out there and just... You know, like, deciding to do it again? <laughs> My leg really hurts, bitch. Who knew that there was a parakeet hospital? Nah, it's called, it's called, a, it's called like a, uh, a veterinary hospital. Oh, is that with the dogs and cats and things in here? Did, did you know that there are some gerbils in here with the flu? <laughs> no, we did not know this. <laughs> it's okay. So... Hope you got your broken wing. Ollie, broken leg. Blue has a mild concussion. And well, I didn't have anything, so I guess I can just go get you guys drinks and things or whatever you need. Oh man, Smalls, thank you so much, buddy. So what did happen again anyway? I'm tired. Lay tired. <laughs> Blue. <laughs> Dude, you, you cracked your head pretty hard, man. You got yourself a mild concussion. I have one. Don't worry about it, man. Is it like a Butterfinger bar? <laughs> no, Blue, it's not a candy bar. It's a concussion, man. It knocked your, knocked your head off, you know? So it's smalls. Oh, that hurts when I talk really fast. I'm like, yeah, I gotta talk slow. Smalls. What happened down there, man? Oh, dude. That's the fastest we've ever gone into those go karts. I don't know what they did to make them go that fast. I think they had nitrous in them. Yeah. Yeah. It was just insane that when they took off and went like that. I mean,. And then, hope spins sideways. No, no, hold on. Don't blame this on me, man. It, it's not my fault. Okay, so, hope didn't spin sideways. Unali, you didn't run into him and flip your car up into the air. No, I didn't. No, no, I not what happened. It is what happened. It is not what happened. Tell him the truth, Smalls. Tell him that the squirrel ran out in front of me and, and it was so big and I tried to stop. Hope quit it. <laughs> you lost control. The car was going too fast. Yeah, it was. Okay. So then Ollie hit Hope's car on the side when it was spinning around and Ollie's car went up in the air. Well, then Blue, who wasn't paying attention, just somehow made it past Hope. But then, Nolly, your car landed on top of Hope. Or Blue. And that's how Blue got a head concussion. <laughs> he doesn't even know what's happening. Dude, that was a sick wreck. All right, so here we are. We're in the hospital, right? Blue can't think straight. Hope can't move his wings and fly, and I can't walk. What are we going to do while we're sitting in here in the veterinary hospital? Well, we can make fun of the dog and the kitty cat. Yeah, we could, too. <laughs> Especially the kitty cats. <laughs> yeah, yeah. We could tease them. Uh, dude, I can't fly. I don't want to tease no kitty cats, just in case. What? They're not, they're not going to be able to get us. Everybody's in a cage. Uh, you know, kitty cats can get out of their cage, don't you? You know that, right? I mean, they just take their paws and they flip the lock and all that stuff. Well, them kitty cats over there don't look smart enough to do that. There's a tabby cat over there. Why, why'd you call it the tabby cat? Because the kitty cat's orange. He's not orange. He kind of, you know, I guess he is kind of orange with stripes like that. Not like orange, like an orange-orange cat, but it kind of like looks like some kind of orange. Yeah, like a, like a tree. You know, like a, like a, 
like a leaf on a tree. He kind of looks like that color. <laughs> yeah, okay, this is true. This is true. Um. Okay. What about the dogs? What are we going to do? We can't fly up and jump on the dogs' back and ride them around. Well, I can. Oh, Smokes, you can, can't you? Oh, yeah. And But these dogs are not good. They're, they're always got problems. And that dog over there, he got his boy things whacked off today. He <laughs> what? Yeah, dude. Hey, we're birds. Do we got those? Yeah. <laughs> Dang straight we do. <laughs> cool. Where do we hide them at? <laughs> they're down there in your feathers, simpleton. Oh, what the heck? It's those. Well, those are your, your dude things, man. Oh, what the heck? How come I never noticed these before? Dude, don't you ever check things out? No, I never check anything out. Well, dude, that's what that is. All right, so listen. Uh, we're going to be here in this hospital for a little while. You know, it's too bad we didn't have, like, an Xbox or some games. We got our phones, dude. Oh, yeah, we do. Hey, hey, hey. Hey, hey, hey. What was that one app we had where you play games with each other? I know they were kind of lame old games, but, like, are there any, like, four-player games in there? Uh, dude, we could do four-player Minecraft. <laughs> yes, we could. We quit. We haven't done that for a long time. Okay, that goes on the list. We need to kind of see it and go to our phones and see what they got in the game center and see if there's any new things like that, because that would be kind of cool, wouldn't it? Well, sure it would. Uh, what else are we going to do? Well, we could wait till nighttime and get out of these cages and we could go adventure around. I'm sure in a couple days, uh, you know, Hope will be able to walk just fine. We'll put uh, Ollie in one of them roll around carts and he can go with us. Do you think we should take Blue out of here? No, dude. We should not take Blue out of here. He's liable to just try to fly home from here. <laughs> yeah. Because he is toast. Yeah. He is toast. No question about it. Feeling okay, Blue? Yeah, Cinnabons. I like those. Those are pretty good. Where are we at anyway? Are we in the skate park? <laughs> no, we're not in the skate park, Blue. We're, we're in the hospital, remember? Uh, okay. <laughs> See, he doesn't... Is he going to be okay? Yeah, they said it's just a mild concussion and for a bird... You know, they're always running into windows and trees and things like that, you know, when we're flying. So I guess it's no big deal. I guess we, we all get concussions all the time. I don't think I ever had a concussion. Well, I don't believe I've ever had a concussion either. Okay, so they think, so we can go out adventuring around tonight? Oh, yeah, we know how to get out of cages. These people don't even have a clue. <gasps> can we go in and get on their voicemail? What? Let's change our voicemail message. What do you mean, change your voicemail? Let's get on our thing and change your voicemail around and make it say something stupid, you know, like, you called the Poison Control Center. Thank you. Oh, oh, wait. Okay, so, thank you for calling the Poison Control Center. If this were an actual emergency, you would report who would... Nah, that one sucks. Uh, hello, this is Terry's Mechanic Shop. You break them, we fix them. <laughs> yeah, that's it. <laughs> so when they, call, when they call here to get their cat fixed, they'll be calling somebody who fixes their car instead. <laughs> yeah, that's, that would be cool. Okay, so when we do our nighttime thing, that's one of the things we can do is get up there and do that. Hey, I got a cool idea. What's that? That's then all the dogs out of their cages. Come on, man. All they do is bark and whine and stuff. If we let them out of their cages, they could go running around and stuff, and they could... Oh, oh, oh. And then we get to hear the kitty cats hissing. <laughs> yeah, that would be well worth coming here to the hospital to get to see a bunch of kitty cats hissing like that. <laughs>
Oh, yeah. Yeah, because when them kitty, oh, you know that's fun stuff, man. It is. I love it. I love it. I love it. Okay, so we're going to get out tonight. We're going to put, uh, put good old Ali leg. <laughs> Ali got the broken leg. Put Ali in the chair. And then we're going to put, and then Hope can walk. And then we're going to cruise around this place. Let's not let the dogs out until we decide we're getting back in our cage. Yeah, true. Because, you know, one of them dogs might be like Blue got bonked on the head and decided he wants to eat himself with the green bird. Yeah. No green birds today, guys. All right, so cool. So, until then, let's check out some of these games on the phone. Well, here, there's player. There's, there's a pool game on there. And I, and I kind of like to play the pool. I know it's not as exciting as the Minecraft and, you know, that warfare game and all that stuff. Yeah, it's not as exciting as that. But, listen, we can take turns. So everybody can kind of check each other out. We can watch this and, you know, see who's doing good at pool. Pool's good. I like playing pool. Yeah, we've had a good time playing pool before. But this is different. It's on the phones. Yeah, let's try that one for a few times. And I don't want to do darts. Well, yeah, but we haven't even gotten around to it. We have to do our dart game when we get back. We're probably going to have to skip the BMX bike racing for a little while. Yeah. Yeah, our little freestyle show is going to have to wait, man, because, you know, everybody's wounded. Except for Smalls. Smalls, we're sorry, dude. You're going to have to help us a whole bunch, man. <laughs> It's okay, guys. I'll be glad to help out. I'm just glad you're all okay and we're going to get big. Hey, by the way, is our go-karts okay? Oh, dude. Those three go-karts, they're going to need a whole lot of work to get back on that track again. But you know how the sparrows are, man. They can fix anything. Yeah, they really can, too. What did they say? They were like, you know... They were just glad you guys were okay, too. And they haven't said a whole bunch of anything else, but they were pretty shocked when you guys went flying up in the air like that. That was a big accident. Dude, I don't think those go-karts should be made to go that fast. No, that was excessive. That was very excessive, fast go-karts. Yeah, it was, too. Yeah, that was, like, crazy fast. All right, listen. Dude. Did you know there's some other birds here in this hospital? I mean, I don't know, but I think I just heard a bird. You heard birds? I'm pretty sure I heard a bird. Smalls, there's nobody out there right now. Go check it out and see what you see down that hallway there with the rooms. Okay, I'll be right back. <laughs> Hello, doggy. <laughs> you can't get dogs. Hey, dogs, listen, tonight, when everybody's gone, we're setting you guys free. Yeah, that's right. You can wipe them tails and later. Yeah, it's going to be pretty cool. Did you guys happen to hear any other birds in here before we came in? Uh-huh. Down that hallway there, there's a bird? Okay, I'm going to go look. Hello, kitties. <laughs> Aw, kitty cats are kind of cool. Yeah. All right, this room here. Oh, dude, there is a bird in here. I can hear him. He's, talk he's talking. Hello? 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 Yeah, who is that? Uh, it's Smalls. Come out, man. I can't see who you are. You don't need to know who I am. Oh, crap. Well, dude, what's up? You okay? No. I got hit. What, what hit you, dude? A horse. Horse? How'd you hit my horse? Dude, hey. What kind of bird are you anyway, man? Parrot. Uh. Are you a big parrot? Or are you just a regular parrot? I'm a very big parrot. Uh, I'll be right back. 
Hang on one just one minute, Major Bear. I'll keep, I'll be back. Dude, 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 dude. Let me get up in the cage here. Hey, it's a parrot. It's a what? You mean parakeet? No, dude, parrot. Big parrot down the hall, round the corner, in the room, and he's not friendly. What do you mean not friendly? Well, I tried talking to him, and he said he wouldn't show me who he was or nothing. And he, he kind of acted like, what kind of business was it to mine? And I was like, well, are you, are you, what kind of bird? And he said, it's a parrot. And I said, are you big or little parrot or regular parrot? He said, big. That's all he said. And then, and, I, and then I got a little weird. And I was like, I better get out of here. Because, you know, a big parrot would eat a parakeet. That is true, man. So we have an Eminem in here. Yeah, you, there's an enemy in here, and and now we're trapped in here in the hospital. And, and Ember can open our cages easy as we can open our cages and get out. Dude, what are we going to do? We're going to have to get prepared for this for the night, because I'm not dealing with no parrot. Oh, man. What the heck? You know, how do we even end up in here anyway in this hospital? Why don't we go to just maybe another place? I think we ought to just get the heck out of here. When well, we can't yet, man. Blue's really not ready to travel. Okay, so listen. We're going to have to deal with this parrot dude. You know he is. He's going to come down here, man. He's a bird. You know and You know how we are, man. We like to agitate things. Well, so much for our fun trip out of the cage for tonight. Right, right, exactly. Now we're stuck in here because there's a parrot. Well, you don't think maybe we go down there and talk to him time when we are kind of like maybe like the Nighthawk and stuff? Dude, I don't think this parrot cares about nothing. He sounds you know, like he's very, very cranky. And I will be willing to bet part of his problem is he's just a constipated bird. Yeah, you think a bird needs to take a crap? Yeah, and that's what's making him crappy in the head. You know what? Absolutely probably right about that, too. Hey, so listen. How do we defend ourselves? We don't have any weapons. We're parakeets. Oh, man. Dude, did you just hear that parrot? Yep. It's a big parrot. He's squawking down there. He's not afraid to let us know he's here now. Yeah, he's claiming territory. Oh, man. This is going to be a rough night. Come on, Blue Man. You guys snap together, dude. We got to get out of this place. Dude, what if we just let the dog loose and the dogs go get him for us? Yeah, right. That would be a better idea than to mess around and wait for this stupid parrot to come down the hallway and decide that we're, you know, like the 2.30 a.m. snack. Right, right. That is exactly what I was thinking. I will pack out his eyeballs. Blue, you couldn't even pick your nose right now, let alone pack out somebody's eyeballs. Uh... All right, listen, dudes. Hey, we're going to work on a little bit of a plan tonight because we got to hang out here with this uh, parrot down the hall. We had a little car accident. Uh, hope you're doing good. And uh, think about this, man. And uh, we're going to try to get better quicker. And uh, we're going to talk to you soon. We'll see ya. <laughs>